Hi, I'd like to talk about the local group of galaxies and the local supercluster or the Virgo supercluster of galaxies. And along the way, look at some galaxies in the local neighborhood of our own Milky Way. And this is an artist's impression of the Milky Way made by mapping the arms. So the sun is located here. The galactic center is here. There's a bar of stars across the center of our galaxy. We live in a barred spiral galaxy, the Milky Way, and the sun is in the disk. There are the spiral arms, and they've been mapped out. The spiral arms can be mapped out by finding four things. We can find the uh, emission nebulas, the bright red emission nebulae that are around those map out the spiral arms because that's where young new stars are lighting up their surroundings. The dark nebulas around, they also follow the location of the star forming regions. The young bright OB associations are uh, producing the most light. So not that many stars producing millions of times of the uh, light of ordinary stars and like more like the sun. The O and B type stars are very luminous. So the fourth is the what's not shown in the picture are the invisible hydrogen gas clouds that can be seen from uh, radio telescopes using radio telescopes. Uh, the 21 centimeter radiation from the spin flip of the electron in hydrogen. So those four things uh, allow us to map the spiral arms of the Milky Way. Now we want to focus on the local group. We have um, this diagram that shows we have the Milky Way galaxy and then we have the, uh, the LMC and the SMC Magellanic clouds and a number of other galaxies and then there's the Andromeda galaxy with some galaxies around it and uh, also M33 the triangular galaxy and those are the three largest galaxies with the Milky Way and the Andromeda galaxy being the largest of those so the Milky Way from inside looks like this this is our picture here and the large Magellanic cloud is here, small Magellanic cloud is here. This is from the Gaia data. This is our, our view from inside the Milky Way. And this is an actual, from actual data, whereas before we don't have that view from the top. So we have to, to construct that map um, as mentioned before. So we have our own galaxy, the Milky Way, our own nearby galaxies. There are quite a number of other smaller companion galaxies to the Milky Way. There's the, um, but the mass of other galaxy in the local group is the Andromeda galaxy called M31 also. And there's, it has some companion galaxies as well. And they um, are part of the Andromeda galaxy system. The pinwheel galaxy, uh, triangulum galaxy, is uh, M33. It's the smaller of the three spirals, but there's maybe 40 or so uh, uh, galaxies in the local group. There are a few that probably have not been discovered that are the, the smallest dwarf galaxies. Here uh, is one that we do know about near the edge of the local group. And uh, we can see this dwarf galaxy doesn't have much structure to it, doesn't have nearly as many stars as the large spirals. Now, if we move out away from the local group, there are quite a number of other groups of galaxies and uh, other very interesting galaxies. This is M82. It's a star forming galaxy. It, there are, uh, in the disk of the galaxy, in the center area, there are uh, stars being formed at rates that are much higher than what happens 
in our own Milky Way. And uh, this is calls it a very violet looking uh, galaxy. And in fact, it is a very violet kind of galaxy. Uh, interesting one, the Whirlpool Galaxy. It has a companion, a smaller dwarf galaxy that uh, is connected by a tail. And um, this is uh, also fairly nearby. Centaurus A is the most violent galaxy in the local area. Here's a composite. We have the optical and X-ray on top. X-ray is for very high temperatures. The optical light is mostly stars with the blocking out of, of dust, uh, the starlight being blocked out by dust and gas. And the radio is the, the jets here, which comes from particles being accelerated out from a supermassive black hole in the center of this galaxy. So not only is there a supermassive black hole in this galaxy, but it is accreting or it is feeding. Material is falling in and it's producing enormous jets and um, uh, uh, the, this, and this is really not a very distant galaxy in part of uh, the, the local uh, superclusters of galaxy. The Virgo uh, cluster of galaxies, this is the heart of the Virgo supercluster. And um, this is about 55, 53 million light years away. And this is the uh, M87 right at the heart of this. There's lots of other galaxies in here. And this stretches out over a much larger space than the screen shows. But this is at the heart of a, the, Vir, the so-called Virgo cluster of galaxies. And the Virgo cluster of galaxies is at the center of a much larger system, which we call the Virgo supercluster of galaxies. Okay, so a supercluster has a very special definition. A supercluster is not simply a large cluster of galaxies. The Virgo cluster is definitely a large, rich cluster of galaxies. But the Virgo supercluster is a cluster of galaxy clusters. So the meaning of a supercluster is where you have a grouping of galaxy clusters. Several galaxy or many galaxy clusters clustered together. And so that's a uh, very uh, high level hierarchy of gravitation binding all of these uh, stars and these galaxies together. And at the, at the heart of the Virgo supercluster is the galaxy M87, and M87 has probably swallowed many Milky Way-sized galaxies, maybe dozens of Milky Way-sized galaxies over its history and it has a tremendous jet coming out of the black hole, supermassive black hole, and we can see that jet here. And these all are stars out here. Sometimes we see globular clusters. M87 has um, many, many hundreds, even thousands of globular clusters. We can see some of the globular clusters here even in this image. Um, there are many nearby Superclusters. So this isn't just the clusters of galaxies. There are superclusters, and this is uh, um, not possible to see details. But just to give you an idea, the universe is quite structured. Galaxies form clusters, and clusters form clusters, and so on.